Welcome! In this video, we're going to learn how to restrict the editing of Word documents. Hello, my name is Mark, and you're watching the Office Master tutorial. Office Master is here to help you learn how to use Microsoft Office in a quick and simple step-by-step -step tutorials. Word 365 has many features that are very useful when creating a document. One of those features lets you restrict editing in Word. When you enable the feature, it prevents anyone from removing or adding content to your documents, keeping them remaining intact. First, navigate to the Review tab in the ribbon. In the Protect group, select Restrict Editing button. In the Restrict Editing task pane that appears on the right side of your screen, under Editing Restrictions, check Allow only this type of editing in the document checkbox. Then select the No Changes Read Only option in the drop down list. To restrict editing in the entire document, confirm the protection of the document by clicking Yes, Start Enforcing Protection right under Start Enforcement. In the Start Enforcing Protection dialog box, you can enter a password to protect the restriction of the editing of the document, or click OK to skip this step. You can see that Word has locked the text of the document and no changes can be made. For example, if you try to highlight some part of the text and erase it, nothing happens. And in the status bar at the bottom of the document, it shows you can't make this change because the selection is locked. To stop the protection of the document, click on the Stop Protection button in the task pane on the right side of your screen. If you want some parts of the text to remain editable, select these parts and in the Exceptions area, click the Everyone checkbox. This will allow everyone to edit the selected areas. If you want to specify who can edit your document, click the More Users button as shown in this video tutorial. In the Add Users dialog box, you can specify a list of users as shown in the example at the bottom of the dialog box. These users will be able to edit the selected areas. Once you're done, click the OK button. Confirm the protection of the document by clicking Yes, Start Enforcing Protection under Start Enforcement. In the Start Enforcing Protection dialog box, you can enter a password to protect the restriction of the editing of the document, or click OK to skip this step. Word automatically highlights areas of the document that are available for editing, as you can see. You can easily edit the highlighted areas. To quickly find editable areas in a longer document, you can use the Find Next Region I Can Edit button. If you found this tutorial helpful, reward us with a like. Is this your first time on our YouTube channel? We would be more than grateful to welcome you to our community, so hit the subscribe button to enjoy more of our videos and learn how to master Word. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.